Introducing the SFR Fit Camera Measurement System. System Configuration SFR Fit uses displays as test charts to create optimized patterns for each measurement. As few as two, and as many as nine displays must be connected to complete the camera test. Place the camera away from the chart display, to ensure relative resolution. SFR Fit will notify the user if the resolution is insufficient. In this case, move the camera further away from the display or use a higher resolution display. In addition, the chart display must be directly facing the camera's field of view to avoid display artifacts. For fisheye cameras, you will need to use multiple displays. Next, let's review the measurement configurations. At first, set the number of the chart displays. And next, set the camera under test. In the measurement settings window, you can set the range of frequency, illumination of chart and chart contrast. When you are ready to start specific test conditions, click the start button. Multiple regions of interest can be set for each display. You can also set the angle of the sign bar chart. The angle of the sine wave bar can also be set for each region of interest, enabling resolution measurements in the sagittal and meridional directions. After clicking the next button, SFR Fit displays a chart on each display and does mapping between camera pixels and display pixels. SFR Fit generates pre-distorted charts, using the mapping data. After generating test charts, it will measure the MTF. Created test charts feature inverse distortion to correct the camera's distortion. The camera under test can therefore get a correct square region of interest from the test charts. And, it can measure partial MTF, using a smaller region of interest. A region of interest of 30 pixels is enough to correctly measure MTF. When the measurement is complete, an MTF plot is displayed. You can choose the MTF graph for each region of interest with the pull-down menu. If you choose multi-MTF, the MTF50 and MTF10 for each region of interest are displayed. As you can see, the MTF decreases from the center of the image to the outside. It can also display the MTF of each R, G, and B channel. And, it can display an OECF graph and sampling waveform of sign bar charts. Measurement data is output as CSV and JSON files. Images of each region of interest in the test can be saved. It is a bar pattern chart, so you can use the image as a reference for visual resolution. In this way, SRF Fit can easily perform sign-based MTF measurements. SFR Fit solves complicated resolution measurement problems. All you need is a display to experience its superior MTF measurement. The trial version is available now. Please visit our download site. Thank you for watching.